Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how easy you can now create this engaging animated subtitle captions effect with highlighting words and background and all the subtitle effects that everybody loves on social media easily in DaVinci Resolve 20. And I'm going to show you how to do it. Let's jump in. Right guys, so the easiest way to create subtitles in DaVinci Resolve 20 is that you select the audio clip and make sure you are in the editing tab down here. And then you go up here on timeline and say AI tools and then create subtitle from audio. And once you click this window opens, you can choose the language. I'll leave it on auto and there's a box to check, which says enable extended language support. And I highly recommend that you download this package from DaVinci Resolve. This makes sure that the AI really gets all the words you say. The caption preset I leave on default and the characters per line, I go on about 20 characters. And you can also choose if it's a single or a double line, I leave it on single and then I say create. And this can take a while depending on the length of your audio clip. This was rather short, so it went really, really fast. And now you can see we have actually a new subtitle track on top of our video track. And you can see there are already subtitles and they are all white and normal. And it's important to know that you should only create subtitles once you finished your edit because you can't move around your clips because then the timing would be messed up. So only generate subtitles when you're really done editing. And to style our subtitles, we go up here on effects and say titles and subtitles. And to get these animated effects, we go on animated. Down here are the old subtitle templates and up here are the new ones which are animated. And what I really like is the word highlight and the statement. And to put this effect into place, it's really important to know that you have to drag and drop these effects down here onto the playhead of your subtitle track. And then you let go. And now when we look at this, we have already this effect into place, but I don't like the style. I want to style it myself. So what we do, we mark all of the subtitle clips and then we go on the very right hand here and say track. And now we can choose the color. I want to go back to a normal white here. I also want to change the font into the font I like, which is inter. And then I go on extra bold italic. And you can see you have all the things you can now make this bigger. We want to change the highlight color, maybe into a gentle yellowish. This looks way better. And then you can also choose a background color if you want that. I mean, that is really quite a lot now. Let's see when well, no, we haven't checked it on now. Now we can see this, maybe the, the normal yellow was not nice enough. I'm going to go back and change this. This looks better to me. All right. So there you have all the facts you need to style your subtitles individually. You can choose your four. You can choose the size, etc. You can also choose a write on effect. Um, that means the words are only coming in while you speak them. So we leave this off for now because I really like the effect, how it is. Let's go a bit closer here and play this again. And this looks already really good to me. I'm quite happy with the styled subtitle captions. And to make sure that the subtitles are really in your exported video, I show you another trick. We go on the export panel. And once you export a video with subtitles, you should always go down here in the subtitle settings. And we want to export subtitles. And now you can choose separate file as embedded captions or burn into video. And when you click burn into video, then the subtitles are really on the video and nobody can click them off. So if you really want to make sure your subtitles with your fall and your special color and all these individual styles are in your video, then always choose burn into video. And then the subtitles are the way you style them. And this is how easy you can now create this animated subtitle captions effect right in DaVinci Resolve 20. And if you found this video helpful, please leave me a like and consider subscribing. More content creation lessons are coming. I hope I see you in the next video.